And she's just like, what? And I'm like, the show is called Unsolved Mysteries. <laughs> <laughs> of course, it was never solved. Uh, a couple of nuggets short of a happy meal your mother was. <laughs> Six-piece meal. Oh, my God. With all her accidents, it's you know, I'm surprised she could still talk at the end. All right, some more of a boy and his blob. All righty. Blob! Here we go. What do you think the other blob's names are? Bloob. Bloob. Bleeb. Goose. Ooze. <laughs> Blib. <laughs> blob. Blib. Blob. Blob. <laughs> Those ones are triplets. <laughs> All uh. right. So another level. We're almost at the end of Bl Blobonia, which is World 3. All righty. Freaking hummingbirds. There you go. I lured you to your death. Huh. Not only the bird, but... Hang on, hang on. Come on. Come on, I want you to do it. I want you to do it. Hit me. <laughs> That's a neat trick, though, that, like, the bird will kill them. You just have to get, like... They, they have to... Hit the actual blob. Mm-hmm. It is a little sad, though, to see their explosion of feathers. Yep. <laughs> oh, oh. I will never forget my mother. We we had a minivan. I thought you were made of goop like everything else. Then you see all the feathers, and it's just like, oh, no. Oh, it's a real bird. My mother drove a minivan, and mm -hmm. we were driving to the store. It was me, my brother, and my mom. Mm -hmm. So my brother and I are in the backseat of the minivan, and she hit a pigeon. <laughs> Like, not a morning dove, but, like, an actual pigeon. Okay. And it popped. Oh, no. And just, like, there was just this whole, like, huge cloud of feathers. Mm -hmm. And the lady behind us, because I remember me and my brother were like, what? And we, like, turned around to look out the rear view, like, the rear view uh -huh. window. And um, the lady in the car behind us was just, like, <laughs> like looking at all the feathers and my mom started sobbing she's like i killed a pigeon pull place. over and sob pull over and sob <laughs> i'm gonna kill another one but it was it was such a weird was there a sound or did you yes just... yes it it popped <laughs> yeah <laughs> it sounded like she ran over a balloon oh wow well Gotta move when a vehicle's coming, little guy. I know. Pigeons in the city are ruthless, man. They can be. I don't know. It's been a while since I've encountered pigeons. Yeah, I'd like it to stay that way. We don't have pigeons up here. Hooray! No, we, we have, just have like the little... We have morning doves. Yeah, morning doves. Yeah. The ones that shit on our cars. Oh my god. They're just like, hmm, the table seems to be empty of bird seed. You know... Gentlemen... All together, <laughs> fire! You know what the worst part is, though? Because we have berry bushes and the mulberry tree. Yeah. So, like, they, they poop the berries. Yes. I, I see it all over the car, and I'm just like, well, I'm going to the yeah. new car wash today. Don't mind me. Yep. All right, so we're actually recording this on the 4th of July. Yes. Just before the fireworks. Oh, yeah. Or as Batman would say, there won't be any fireworks. Eh. I I Hurry. don't know how I this feel about way. the Fourth of July. Uh, I it, think it's, it's fine. I think it's like it's it's nice to celebrate, but some I people just, I feel go a little too hard on it, and I'm just like, well, I don't like the idea of a bunch of drunk people lighting off explosives. <laughs> like it makes me extremely nervous. <laughs> yeah, I knew someone who uh, lost his house because a firecracker went through his window and burned the house down. Oh my god. He wasn't too happy. So, like, he was the first person I ever met who was like, fuck the 4th of July. <laughs> I just, like, I'm fine with having, like, a fireworks display. Mm -hmm. um, because it is, like, a celebratory time. You know, it's the, the day of the independence. You know, whatever. Yeah. But, like, I yeah, don't... Yeah, it's the day Bill Paxton and uh, Will Smith saved us from the aliens. Yeah. <laughs> like, we all would have been enslaved by aliens mm -hmm. and exploded. Um, but anywho, like, yeah. I just don't like that every single town has a fireworks display for a full month. Well, it like, was recent that, like, certain fireworks were allowed in PA. Yeah. 
Cause, like, well, because I know there was no mortars. Like mm-hmm. you had to have you had to get them from Ohio. a license. Yeah, you had to have yeah. a license to buy mortars, mm-hmm. and now you can have mortars. And I'm like, they're so freaking dangerous. Like, well, I remember can be. we went to see like our city's fireworks display, and some random asshole decided to buy mortars, mm-hmm. and he went to light one off, and it tipped over. Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> and like we were all running from like fucking explosives because it tipped over because you're not licensed to handle an explosive. Oh, I've been there. Also, don't uh, hate it. put them in upside down. God. It gets dark and some people have a couple beers in them. They put it upside down and that whole thing goes pow! Yeah, like it just seems like the dumbest like, idea that there could be. Like, yeah, 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 it's fine. It doesn't matter. You drank a whole case of beer. Just go ahead. Light it off. Light off the quarter stick of dynamite. Who yep. gives a shit? Yeah, who gives a shit? <laughs> like... <sighs> That's the American way. I just, cause I'm fine with like the sparklers and the little firecrackers and I like, like bottle rockets. Yeah, like the the little, <laughs> like the little displays of fireworks. Like those are fine. Uh, you know, I hate that they litter the streets on the fifth, but yeah, that happens. Like clean up after yourself. Cause like we used to go to Ohio, and this was when I was a kid, and like, we get like. All bunches, and yeah. then like the following morning, it was like me and a buddy who spent the night. It's just like, all right, guys, we got to clean the yard. Yeah, <laughs> it was about an hour just getting Cleaning everything up all and the... all these garbage bags yeah. and stuff, getting all the shrapnel and the little pieces of paper like, and stuff like that. My aunt and uncle um, that lived down the street, uh, they would always get me and my siblings like this huge trash bag mm-hmm. of just like fireworks that were small. They were small fireworks, like right. this, you know, packs and packs of sprink, uh, sparklers. Oh. and check this out. This is like lighting the fuse. So wait for it. All right, Blob. You better wait. get so to running before you're in the splash it? zone. Okay, can't do it that way. What about... Okay, we'll set it off. All right, Tim, fire. All right, here we go. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ah. All right, we're safe here. Okay. Their splash doesn't go through the wall. Well, I, I do move a little to the left right there. <laughs> just like, in case. Just in case, because this game likes to pull that kind of shit. All right. So now we're going to pop down here. And we're going to do it again, little boy. We're going to do it again. Oh, they're starting. I heard the first yep. crack. The first Not crack of the morning. Not even 10 a.m. yet. At the crack of dawn. The first um, fire. <laughs> Is delivered. But I remember, like, they stopped giving us fireworks whenever I think it was my sister's like first boyfriend okay. came over, and he took a Roman candle. Oh Jesus! And All was right. chasing people with it. Oh no! And they were like, "That's it, no more fireworks." Yeah. <laughs> Always takes one idiot yeah. to ruin yeah. the fun for everyone. And it was just like we had like I really enjoyed the like small displays where you would like set it in the street and you would light the fuse and right. then you would like run away and and it would like have like a mini firework like it didn't explode but it was like a sparkler on a stick. Okay, I get thing. it. Like mm-hmm. it was just those were really fun. <laughs> but they also didn't make any loud popping noises. It would just go off. Yeah. You know. For our bottle rockets, we'd uh obviously like pop them in like a beer bottle or yeah. something and just like light them off. Yeah. My brother always liked the like big boom fireworks. I liked the pretty sparkly ones. I liked a little bit of both. Like setting off mortars was fun. Yeah. Some of those like big like a hundred shots in one. Yeah. And you're like Yeah. Just again aim them away from the porch. Yeah. <laughs> but I Oh it's story time. Oh. Than anything he wanted power. Power only humans had. He invaded the villages and enslaved the blobs in his factory. Beautiful Blobonia was dying. One day, an earth boy came to save Blobonia. He was very brave and carried a lot of candy. Oh, candy! Oh, the king candy. was not pleased. He had to stop the boy. This is where our story begins. So there we go. Story time. Boy's like, hey, that's me. <laughs> they wrote a book about me <laughs> while I was dying. <laughs> Did it mention my 96 deaths? 
No. Okay. I love it. He had a lot of candy. Based on a true story. He left out all the times I died. (laughs) And that's what we call based on a true story. Oh my god. I love the the ones that are like unsolved mysteries. And because my mother used to do this. Unsolved mysteries. And then you watch the entire show. Mm -hmm. And at the end they go, and the case was never solved. And she's just like, what? And I'm like, the show is called Unsolved Mysteries. (laughs) (laughs) Of course it was never solved. Uh, A couple nuggets short of a Happy Meal your mother was. (laughs) Six piece meal. Oh my God, with all her accidents, I'm surprised she could still talk at the end. Mm Mm-hmm. Yep, 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 yep. All right, this is definitely not the angle. Ah, you son of a whore. Come on. The blob's like I'm moving and grooving. All right. Speed marker. All right, let's position ourselves. Oh, you're going to hit the blob. Oh, come on. He'll move. Shoo. Shoo. It's like Wesker when you're trying to walk past him. And yep. he's like, nah. There we go. We I got it. I think I will. <laughs> Gosh, he was so cute, though, whenever he had to go outside last night, but we were watching a movie. Mm-hmm. We did eventually pause the movie so that he could go outside. Yes. But um, I was laying down, and he he would just come over and he'd bump my face. Yep. I'm like, buddy, what do you want? Give me kisses. Kissy kisses. I want to poop. <laughs> Alrighty. Ready? Oh boy, my favorite. Hurry. Time for the root beer Over rocket. <laughs> Talk about that. Come on, Blob. Get the fuck up here. Jesus. Oh, a happy day when the credits roll on this game. This is a game about patience. Fucking come on. At least he woke up right there. He didn't have to do it again. Thank God it wasn't a challenge stage. Or you'd hear this house rattle. Oh my God. God damn it. I know you said that you were going to record more. I think I'm going to do yard work. <laughs> you see the house shake. Mm. <laughs> well, I was outside. I was doing some resin projects. And I heard you from outside. Uh-oh. Screaming at the TV. And the neighbors are just like, I'm like, video games. It's really? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Um, but that's just because she was outside doing yard work, too. Okay. So. And she was like, my grandson does the same thing. <laughs> like, Yeah. Oh, yeah, you can relate. It just ruins my whole goddamn day, though, whenever I get, like, mad at a video game. It doesn't ruin my day. It's just like, okay. Oh, my God. When we were playing Rayman, like, my whole day was ruined. I was like, stupid game. Yeah, I know. You kind of sulked for a bit. Yeah. You're just like, how did they make game so hard? It ruined my whole day. (laughs) Best part of the sandwich. Ruined. Rayman ruined it. But like I said before, like, don't count out the entire series. Because, no, like, no. two is really because good. I understand. I haven't played three, but I heard three was pretty good as well. I understand as well that, like, the first one was, they're, like, they were just testing things out. Mm-hmm. They're seeing what they could do. And With it, this hardware. It, yeah, yeah, and it is a beautiful game. It's yeah. very pretty. And, like, the music is really nice. It just, like, the actual game mechanics just really suck. <laughs> All right. I guess this is not what I'm supposed to do. I gotta get up there. This He's way. walking my way. Okay. Um, launch him off the trampoline, throw him through a cannon. He can't ride my rocket. I think the only thing I can do is put him in a cannon. It's the only thing I can think of. Or just jump over him. That works too. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? I think I should get out of here. What would you do if it just started climbing the ladder? Piss and moan for a while. (laughs) That's like people that climb trees to get away from a bear. So the bear starts climbing up that tree and they're like, oh shit, oh shit. Bears can't climb trees? Yeah, well, neither can I. So that tree had to come down. John Burnett, when he's just like, did you know they hide the food? They hang it from the trees because bears can't climb trees? He's like, yeah, well, neither can I. So I chopped that tree down. It had to come down. I don't know if I bit it down in blind fury. 
Next day, the forest ranger's yelling at me. He's like, listen, I was starving. Here's $50. Buy a tree. Bears can climb trees. Some can. Yeah. Hmm? I know, like, um, aw, oh, what's the one? But, like, park rangers, sloth they'll... Sloth bears? Mm-hmm. I don't think you're gonna see a sloth bear in, like, well, no, national no, no. park. Yeah. I mean, not our national park. Not our national park, exactly. They're an Asian bear. Yeah. Shit. Oh, boy. Oh boy, you know, oh they, boy, they oh could boy. have made this uh, game really, really fucking morbid by adding little skeletons on those spikes. <laughs> from all the boys that have tried before. <laughs> you think this is... You think this boy is like the 50th boy that... Yeah. Uh, tried Blob to save tries Blabonia. to recruit? Just like, hey, I've done this a couple times before. God, no. Oh, no. I feel like Blob is kind of like uh, Philatides from... Hercules. Rule number 96! AIM! <laughs> when he's just he's just trying to do his best and he looks at boy like oh, another Achilles. Mm -hmm. Like Oh, another Achilles. of all the boys that have tried before. That's pretty funny. Cause it's either that or like each time you die, there's a new set of skeletons. Oh yeah. <laughs> so you start another life and like, whoop, there, there's my last point. Like, oh, it's kind of like Dark Souls. That's the boy that tried before. And like, if you die, it leads behind like a little aura that contains the souls you've collected. Oh. But if you die again, you lose those souls. So like, it creates this kind of like, I gotta get my souls. Yeah. It's kind of like addiction, but it's also like deceiving in a way because like you don't want to be obsessive about souls because then you don't take risks yeah because if you take risks you're rewarded with souls because souls is like currency yeah. you get it from defeating monsters like experience but you also get it by like discovering secrets and stuff okay. like that and like you can also find items and craft souls out of the items oh so like it's more than just kill things to get souls. I like that boy gets launched off the rock. Yep. Oh no! Ah! I don't know. At this point, I'm just like fuck it. Head down, boy. Head down. Let's try this again. And this is why we do post commentary. Yeah. Or because else. it would be like, oh, you fuck, boop, boop. Yeah, or else you would have heard lots of swears. I think this uh, microphone would just combust. Yeah, it would just <clears> catch <throat> on fire. Uh, all right. This is the final chest. Gimme. Don't worry, I'll just use my body to break this wall. Yay. Hip hip boo. <laughs> All right, get ready. We got a boss fight coming up. Oh boy. We're gonna carry this boss fight into the next part, but we're gonna show you a sample to just realize what kind of hell we're getting involved in. Oh, I think this was one of the times that I was outside and I heard you. It's highly possible. So this is the giant blob bird. So to beat him, we're gonna use the cannon. Because I figure that's the only way to do it. And he's going to shoot these little blob balls, which will be the cannon's ammunition. But also, you got to walk over the cannon. Fuck! Otherwise, he'll get sucked into the cannon. So it's just really annoying. Physics that are fighting you as you're just trying to take down a boss. Yay, game design. We yeah. really thought this through. All right. It looks like he's dropping it. So what I like to do is hop over the, uh, what, what's the entry point of a cannon called? The barrel? Yeah. The cannon barrel? Yeah, I try to, like, hop over that so it doesn't yeah. suck me in. There we go. All right, move up. Launch. There he is. Now bring the blob to me. And he's stunned. So now... And like, what's nice is you can walk through his wings. Okay. The wings don't count. I was just be like, oh, okay. Like, he didn't kill you there? Oh, I'd be spitting blood. <laughs> there we go. And then you smack him with an anvil. You gotta do that three times to win. Here. It's like a little cartoon. On paper, sounds simple. In execution, it's a pain in the fucking ass. Oh my god, it's like communism. Yeah. 
Ah, you're getting it. Communism is just a red herring. Facts. <laughs> or in this case, yeah. a big old black herring. There we go. Oh, come wow. on. That didn't count. It splattered. Splish splash. There we go. How? See? So, like, I know what I have to do. It's just doing it's it. It's just doing it. Which I'm just like, I get it. Sometimes, like, that's very complicated, and that's the challenge in and of itself. But I just hate when the mechanics fight me. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, hey, Blob, you gotta hurry up and do this transformation before... Oh, fuck. Okay, so the tip of the wing doesn't count as a hit. Sorry, we're so particular. I guess your hitbox is more closer to the body. Huh. Right, maybe we can do this again. Nope, nope, not what I wanted. Alrighty, so well, in the next part, we're going to actually face this boss. And do it correctly. See you then.